ladies and gentlemen, you may simply know me as Logamus Prime, and welcome back to yours truly doing the reaction thing to the ancient Omega's Bride. Holy crap, the last few episodes have been insanely, insanely good. Well, not that the show was bad or anything, but these ones were outrageously violent and awesome. Elias transform into this weird giant thing, monster guy, kind of almost lost control, but then she said kind of brought him back to life if you will, or brought him back down to earth. And the same thing can be said about Chise. Chise was losing control. She was, you know, getting really mad. You know, she was using a lot of energy. She was exhorting a lot of energy. And, and Elias brought her back to her, you know, life for earth and ground her. We met the big bad uh, Joseph and sort of got a little bit of his motives. We met uh, a black dog who's now Bruce, who is uh, Chise's familiar. No, I'm starting to theorize that Elias is sort of similar like the Black Dog. Like, what if Elias was, I don't know, like a fairy? What if he was just some sort of monster that became a mage, right? What if he was never human? What if he's always desired to be human, right? No matter all the magic skills, no matter how strong he's gotten throughout the years, uh, the one thing he's always wanted to do or be it was is human, right? There's so much layers under Elias. He's such a mystery and hopefully in this episode we get more more answers so i apologize to all the awesome people out there who've been leaving me comments and like yo back off elias he's not a big guy he's not trying to rape jeez hey i i can i can see the light i see it <laughs> thank you guys so much for the feedback now what does this episode bring us today i mean after the aftermath after that big battle after she say getting a familiar after elias transforming like what what's gonna happen hopefully she say gets to learn more techniques more magic techniques and i'm all up for that all right guys so this is what i'm gonna do i'm gonna watch the episode i'm gonna dissect it i'm gonna commentate i'm gonna react to it and then by the end of the episode i give a quick overall opinion of what i just watched and where i think the show is going to go so without further ado let's do it episode nine ancient mega's bride let's go I haven't discussed this in a while, the intro. Uh, compared to some of the other animes that I've been watching on my channel, I do like some of their music. As far as this intro, I don't necessarily dislike it, but I don't like it neither. I don't hate it. I'm just not, I'm not vibing it. It's not a bad intro by any means. It's just... I don't know. I don't like the song. I find myself skipping it every episode. Oh, Isabel. That's too soon. Isabel. Oh my god, that dog. I'm getting accustomed to my How did he get his red eyes though? I don't think I they would. explained that. Shocker. She's doing laundry. Yo, I do appreciate how Chise wears different outfits or different clothing in each episode. I love that because it keeps the show really uh, for real? The hell's wrong right with the dog? Oh, sorry. I was so excited I couldn't stop myself. What? what? You like it here? I'm glad. This guy attacked you! He's a bad dog! Elias won't leave his room? <laughs> Why? Is he, like, embarrassed? We should go, Bruce. By the way, I thought I she named the dog Bruce. So um, fight. she named the dog Ruth. The act of changing shape draws a lot of energy. Ruth. You know, yeah. like, like... Ruth, R R U T H, like not know, Bruce, like Batman. Remember. Guess it hasn't quite I messed sunk up. In yet. The dog. As much as I hate to admit it, yes. <laughs> Aw, she said looks really cute in short shorts. <laughs> Don't judge me. Okay. By the way, she just doesn't, um, you know, fit up? in this what's world, up? sewer lady. Wait, I don't understand. What's Why going is she on? kicking her out of the kitchen? Hey! What is she doing? Looks like she gave us some spending money at least. Fallen. Let's go shopping. Is it really safe for me to just wander around? You have me now. Hey there! It's been a long time. Oh! Is oh, hi, Angelica. Is Angelica? You're doing well. She's my favorite character, by the way. I'm sorry for yelling. Sorry. <laughs> Elias is sort of busy today. I dropped by to check on you. Oh yeah. Came to check up on you, baby girl. Oh, look at that. They're like having like little bond moments, but we're not hearing the conversation. We're not going on montage. 
Would have been cool. I wonder what they're talking about. Like Eliza's penis. <laughs> oh, look. They're in England. She's always stretched a bit too thin. Shut up! And using magic leaves her feeling especially <laughs> Oh. I knew it! <laughs> I think she was gonna flick her. It's about as strong as it gets, but your body's weak. You have to start right, I, I think I'm okay with Angelica patting Chise. I'm a okay. little biased. Uh, school's not my thing. I like my life the way it is. That's very Besides, interesting. I'm in the garden and studying magic. They're talking about how come she doesn't go to school. Season has its own chores to do and That's more than enough. But for you me. need an education. None of that means you need to be tethered to him for the rest of your life. Ooh. Ooh. I'm really sorry. I didn't mean to react like that. Sorry. No, what I, the? no I was the one being intrusive. But you're right. No, 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 no. Angelica's right. Oh my, look at those boots. I'm, I'm just saying. Angelica's right, though. Sorry. She saying does need to step up. She can't just rely on people all the time. I mean, yeah, she's just Again, a little I'm sorry girl. About earlier. Don't be. No, 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 no. I honestly no. appreciate that you actually care. That's pretty honest. I really be like good, this. But not too good, understand? Bye bye, Robin. Oh, we yeah. barely knew that. Bye bye, Angelica. Man, she should have stayed around. Oh, this Elias, guy still won't get out of his room. Are you okay in there? Like, what if he has to use the bathroom? Come on, open the door. Maybe he's naked. Whoa, what? It's like, okay, I thought it was like Elias? pitch dark in there. Are you in here? I. Jesus! Jesus, I'm sorry. I'm having some difficulty keeping my form stable. I realize it must be frightening. But would you mind staying for a little while, please? What are you gonna like, masturbate in front of her? Condition. I don't like explain this to me tomorrow. Yes. I don't like how she's sitting on him. What is going on? There's nothing remotely human about his body. Monstrous limbs. Face. I didn't know skin. he was like a snake. He's like a slug. But I'm not scared at all. I'm not scared. This is gross! Oh, he's, oh, he's like, oh. <laughs> what is she doing? Go kick his ass. He, he puts a finger anywhere. I wish I'd never had you. I wish you'd never been born. <laughs> what the hell has gotten to the show? Oh, come on. She's taking a shower or bath afterwards the way? next morning. That means that they what did something. Yeah, I wonder why Silver Lady doesn't speak. I wonder if that answer has already been answered. Or question. What question? <laughs> what are they playing? Hide and go seek? You would think that she would know an ability to uh, sense to Elias. Please tell me that you're feeling better now. Yes, I am. Thank you. Whoa, speaking of... Back off. I don't trust the way you smell. <laughs> so, uh... You must be Chise's new familiar. It's like you've got a... I'm not going to question brother. that. <laughs> Sorry, I haven't seen him around. Thanks, anyway. uh, my question is, is that since this is taking place on the day after... I think you might be picking up some of his bad habits. Um, I'm surprised that uh, Chise healed so this quick from her getting attacked. We, we didn't even get to... See her heal or have any bandages. She went shopping. I completely Wait, forgot about that. Why, hello there. Yes, hello. Creepy old I guy. Seen you around here before. And that's because we've only recently. Oh, really protective dog. Oh, yes, that explains that. <laughs> now I realize we're off the beaten path. What? Bit, but it truly is lovely. Look at that hear. ass! I'm sure you'll adore your new home. Enjoy Damn. the gardens. Is the Leanne on she? Act like muses, but they're parasites. Wow, that's rich. Yeah, I mean, with she's not even wearing anything. Uh, this old codger will die if you try to feed off him. So you're Thorn's new bride, huh? Apprentice. <laughs> <laughs> Let go of me. Let you know if I find him. 
But Ruth, wait, 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 wait. Oh, don't mess with her, Leanne on she, or I'll tear you apart. Um. <laughs> I live here by myself. Why would uh, funny, Ruth leave she say alone with the weird looking fairy with naked with girl? All right. Now, thing. My name is Joel. All right, you probably don't have the time. <laughs> The truth is, I'm not all that great at reading, so it might take me a while to get through it. Well, that's not a problem. This is why you should go back to school, woman. Well, she's having a very particular day. She went shopping, she's meeting new friends. He wrote a love What is with this lady? What is she seeing that old guy? Like, you didn't help. You why is she naked? Using him to... Our eyes met once. It was oh. years ago, and only for a moment. It's all about love. I can't partake of his blood. I can't give him my inspiration. I'm not sure what to do. Duh! She said, do you have any idea what these strange feelings are? Oh man, I, I've been there. I know how that feels. That's cute. She do need some clothes, woman, though. I'm sorry for long ago I glimpsed a beautiful lady out here. Something about her was almost otherworldly. That must sound. Whoa. He's is he finally seeing her? Again? Wow, I mean, she stayed with him for Those years. Feelings, I think you're probably Thank you, but that answer is not the one I want to hear. For my kind to love a human would mean devouring that person. So no, there's absolutely no way I can love him. <laughs> you should come visit again! I know it would make Joel happy. Aww, that's cute. I found him. He's deep in the woods, north of the house. Well, they're, they're talking telepathically? Or in the dog? God, man, the animation looks beautiful! It's like they stepped their game up today in this episode. There. <laughs> what is wrong with them? Oh, don't start this crap. Listen to what Angelica said. Stop being... She say it's uh, dangerous to come into the forest. I want to know what's happening to you, though. I want to know what kind of creature you are. I do too. It doesn't matter what I ask. You always avoid answering. Yeah, can give us answers already. It doesn't mean I want to stay ignorant forever. But I haven't seen I've her be seen that her way. Face before. She say doesn't come off like she's recluse. I accept most of what you tell me, but you can't just vanish like that. It's called space, lady. You you're being too attached. You're sitting in half of what he says is a lie. I think. No, it's I not. I used to not care when he tried to hide things from me. Why does it scare me so badly now? Mm. Interesting questions. As for, I'd like time to organize my thoughts first. I don't want to wait anymore. Are you angry? No, no, I'm not angry. I'm not <laughs> angry. Then why wear yet another odd face? Look, I told you. I'm not oh, angry. you're about to learn what relationships are all about. <laughs> Oh my god, more right? characters. They literally drop from the sky. Pastor Linda, he has business with a young one. She's to come at once. Oh, the, the dragon guy. Yeah. Wow, guys. Um, Crap, I, I hope the show keeps going in this level because this is my favorite episode so far in the show. I loved how grounded it felt. Just the fact that, you know, Chise was just being alive if you will she went out shopping she went and explored if you will and there was not even that much dialogue it was all visual and it was brilliant the way it was told you know today's episode pretty much was about um Elias being recluse because you know in the previous episode he transformed into his true form and he couldn't he, he just forgot how to hold it back or keep it back so he wanted some time away from Chise. Chise is too, I don't know, maybe she's too attached to lies that she didn't want to see him, uh, you know, be kept in the shadows. He, she didn't want him to just be so recluse that she she's like, yo, I don't care how you look. I want to see you. But Elias is like, no, I need some space. So he disappeared and Chise trying to look for him. 
and she did. Now, we also met another character. We met an older man, and there was, like, I, I want to believe it was, a, like, a succubus, like, some sort of ghost lady that is haunting him. But she's not trying to kill the guy. She's very infatuated and in love with the guy. Which, again, goes with my theory about how the show, is, you know, its biggest theme is about love and death. Like, when I watched Naruto right from the beginning, I always thought that the biggest theme of the show was uh, was about bonds. It was about love. It was about friendship. And when you watch it from the first episode all the way to the end of the episode in Shippuden, that was the biggest thing. It was always about bonds. And I'm sensing that here as well. It's like every episode reminds you. It's like one episode's about love, the next episode's about death. And I don't necessarily know exactly where the show is heading, or where it's going with this kind of theming, but uh, it's very apparent. At least I'm seeing it that way. I didn't agree with how the show is trying to show that she say is too, you know, like she can't live without a lie. It's like she needs someone to help her live her life. And I like how the show's attacking these moments. Like Angelica and Elias are both telling she say to like, yo, you need to cut it out, chick. You need to grow up. You can't rely on me forever. And I like that. Like, at least that's how I'm looking at it that way. She says still a very young girl, you know, and she's blooming into adulthood. And I, I like how the show is not scared to talk about these subjects. Now, of course, I'm still creeped out. You know, Chise did confront Elias when he was still all transformed and all gooey and weird. And he's like slobbering all over her and Chise sexually you know, laying on tie. It's just, it's weird to me still. Until we get that actual character development about Elias and what he's about and where he's been and blah, blah, blah. I, then I'll really will believe what Elias' motives are. But it's still very creepy. I, I'm, I don't know. I understand it's a very beauty and the beast kind of romance, but I'm, I'm not digging the romance aspect of the show. Alright guys, that about wraps up today's episode. Leave me any positive or negative feedback down in that comment section. Feel free to like my video or subscribe to my channel. I appreciate it if you do. And as always, keep peaceful, enjoy the rest of your day, and bye-bye for now. See ya.